Join me, Terry Bradshaw, as I explore all that's new and exciting about the USA and Canada and what people are doing in order to make a difference. It's an easy way to see what's happening across your own country. Welcome to Today in America. An hour west of Green Bay in central Wisconsin, there's a small town of 4,600 with flowers on its main street, as well as small friendly shops and high school sports on Friday night. Clintonville has been the source of innovations that have revolutionized trucking and air travel. But there's a lot more to this city's story. It's even the site of a modern mystery. Clintonville is a fabulous place to raise a family open a business or just to visit here. Um, We truly are a community with a big heart. Through good times and bad times, our neighbors will come together to help with whatever needs to be done. I've lived in Clintonville for 66 years and I'm proud to call Clintonville my hometown. The pride Clintonville residents take in their hometown shows throughout the city. The generosity and hard work of the community recently built a new high school complete with an auditorium, fitness center, and indoor pool. The community has rallied to fund construction of a new football stadium as well as a beautiful veterans memorial. Thirteen parks dot the city while walking trails run along the river and around the city's pond making for easy access to fishing and boating. There's even an 18-hole golf course. Clintonville is a place where my father saw an opportunity to start our family business. The community has been good to us. They've supported us. The city government supports us. When you've got a community that supports you, it allows you to grow and thrive. And it's allowed us to grow from a small storefront of three employees to now this state-of-the-art 24,000 square foot facility with over 30 employees. As well as public and private school systems, the city is also home to the Fox Valley Technical College, providing local workers with job-specific skills. The area's workforce is reliable and dedicated. Employers usually see little turnover. The city's business-friendly approach helps entrepreneurs by being creative and flexible, saying yes to projects that grow the community and create jobs. We wanted to be in a smaller town with access to major transportation channels. We were also very impressed by the people. The people have a tremendous work ethic. They know how to work hard. And lastly, the city of Clintonville went out of its way to demonstrate to us their commitment to our growth and success and they have been our partner every step of the way. Clintonville's airport is the birthplace of Wisconsin Central Airlines, which eventually grew into Delta Airways. And it was in Clintonville that FWD invented the first four-wheel drive technology, later to merge with Seagrave Fire Apparatus. Today, Seagrave supplies fire trucks and equipment to fire departments across America, including Los Angeles and New York City. Following the events of September 11, 2001, Seagrave went into overtime replacing the fire vehicles lost on that day. It was then that the people of Clintonville rallied once again, donating a fire truck to the nation's Big Apple. Well, F.W. Seagrave has a very rich tradition here in Clintonville since 1909. And we have a very high quality workforce uh, that have developed uh, expertise over decades building the safest, longest lasting, most durable truck in the industry. This business experience matters. In March of 2012, the term boomtown took on a new meaning in Clintonville. For three weeks, mysterious booms could be heard and felt around town. The U.S. Geological Survey traced the sound to a series of minor earthquakes, the largest measuring 1.5 on the Richter scale. I heard the booms and so did hundreds of other residents. People at that time didn't know what the sounds were from, but we did determine that they were earthquakes. For the first couple days, people were afraid because we didn't know what was the cause of those sounds. But in the end, I really believe that we came together, we worked hard and were resilient while we looked for answers, and I think we're stronger because of it. This is a city of innovations, yet Clintonville's warmth and friendliness is nothing new. 